every day I, I try to describe soul. Maybe you mm. can hum eight bars of what soul represents. Mm. What we're doing is putting on a production that is called The Eight Bars of Soul. We will be presenting this in a concert fashion with some scenes in between. creative journey I've done everything except a black <laughs> thing <laughs> and I'm black right so for me that's personal Georgia. Georgia. Just an old sweet song Keeps Georgia on my mind Well, I just looked at America and what was going on and I just said, my God, how could this be? It was in my soul that I, I felt the rhythms I kept hearing those eight bars of soul over and over in my head. Kept hearing that sound you hear in church, like a heavenly orchestra, that blessing music. I was born by the river in a little tent. Oh, just like. It's been a long, a long time. I wanted to tell a story about black music and black people, how that music is very significant when it comes to those artists that grew up in the church. My father was Pastor C.L. Franklin of New Bethel Baptist Church in Detroit, Michigan. Church, <laughs> I grew up under that roof day and night, which is why this, uh, this light pop music you about to hear, you got eight bars of church all up in there. The moment I wake up, before I put Eight Bars of Soul speaks to uh, the African-American experience. You hear and hear it in each of these songs, some part of the Eight Bars of Soul. Thank you, Mr. Gay.